Good day, Leo, and welcome to my channel. I'm Misha, the Psychotic Psychedelic Gypsy, and this is your weekly reading for May 1st to the 7th. If you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I hope you're all doing well, and I hope this reading resonates with you. Also, for those of you that don't know, stay until the end of the video, and there will be a link to a bonus reading where I pull uh, one tarot card for you. Universe speak. Spirit's guide. What needs to be known? What lessons need to be learned? Seven of hearts. Six of hearts. Three of clubs. And the Queen of Hearts. Okay, so if you are with somebody, they love you sincerely and unconditionally. And they want to put a ring on your finger. If you're not with somebody, then, well, if you're with somebody throughout this week, they might ask you to marry you uh, in, in this week. Uh, if you're not with somebody, then throughout the week, somewhere throughout the week, you're going to meet somebody that loves you sincerely and unconditionally, and this person wants to put a ring on your finger. So if you meet a love interest this week, uh, you probably go for it. At the beginning of the week, you need to stop. You're doing too damn much. You need to rethink your priorities. Anything that isn't an absolute priority for you, like doing stuff for somebody else, but it's not like something that has to be done, you can like, just kind of cut it, cut the fat, let it go, you know, do that. And then go back to your priorities and focus on one priority at a time. Finish it and then repeat. Do another one. Uh, in the middle of the week, you might be thinking about a past love. Uh, it can be a, an ex or a good friend or a soulmate or even a family member. Uh, whoever it is, uh, you had a falling out with them and they're trying to come back and the cards say to forget this forget this past uh this person uh whoever they are they may seem like they've changed maybe they've changed for a bunch of other people you know and you've seen that but that change is not for you okay even if you get back together with this person and they you know everything's good it might be good for like a week it might be good for a whole month who knows but uh either way the cards say don't repeat it because this person really hasn't changed for you whatever broke you up in the first place is going to come back uh it's going to repeat itself or it's just going to be there as a blocker and it's just not going to be worth your time so just don't even bother don't don't repeat uh, but at the end here, it looks like you will cut the fat, you will focus, you will forget the past, you know, you will understand the sincere and conditional love that you have, because absolute success, uh, the three of clubs, uh, this card trumps all cards, it, it assures that everything that you need to do, or that you should do, you will do, and you will be successful and uh you'll be famous and fortunes and all that good stuff and i i really want to change how that is but that's how you know people perceive it as fame and fortune so fame and fortune is yours that just means that people are going to gravitate to you more they're going to be interested in you more you're just going to be popular and uh you're going to get abundance some kind of abundance it's going to be good and all these things you will get through them you will do what you should be doing uh, to handle these things so yeah and the end of the week this might be when this person pops the question on you i don't know anyway i hope this resonated uh if it did hit that like button and if you would please comment share and subscribe uh, i hope to see you next week and until then stay safe stay mindful and stay healthy